What is up guys, Clinter here, and with the start of the Saiyan Saga campaign, they decided to Zenkai this Goku, the one who fought Raditz, and he's looking like a really good Zenkai. Ton of support ability, and as you can see I just have a bit of arts boost, but he has almost 200k defenses just with that. Pretty promising overall, and I'm deciding to run him with LF Piccolo. Now LF Piccolo is far from a good unit, to say the least, but it's gonna be a fun time. Also running uh, Bardock and Goku just as a good third option. But yeah, this is the team. Let's hop right into PvP and see how they do. Okay, first match up against a pretty good looking team. It's LOE, of course. With the... Okay, catch him there. The number one unit in the game right now. Golden Frieza. Gotta go right away to get uh, Barku's cover now. Can't be forgetting that. Let's swap over here. Kinda wanna get the full gauge going with them. Okay. Go for taps. Yeah, LF Piccolo. Man, they should have like awakened his plat equip instead of the UI stuff. Like, uh, he's given him a broken awakened plat. And he. Arts increase kind of sucks there. I'm just gonna go for this though. He, yeah, he swaps into revival. That's fine. He's saving comeback. The ultimate with this guy is pretty good. Uh, it gives buffs, heals, and stuff. So yeah, solid sub counter reduction. Well, combination of the main and the ultimate. No, oh, that's a long animation. So you can go pretty safe there. That's fine. You're gonna have to give up something here. Okay. Come back. All right, pretty good so far. We've been uh, kind of demolishing this team, to be honest. So uh, going to Piccolo here. Yeah, charge up that special beam. Oh, come on, kill him. Ah, uh, I've forgotten how much this does. Let's go. That's <laughs> Piccolo with the clutch kill on Golden Frieza. Ah, uh, that pretty much. One as the match there, for the most part. Yeah, now he can't really do anything. And I think this was... Uh, let's see here. Okay. It's pretty much perfect. Alright. Looking good. Okay. Sun fan team here. Uh, was one of the best teams in the game. Doing faster, okay. Wow. Hello? Are you kidding me? Uh, some of these matches are pretty laggy. It is reset day, so. Okay, that. Okay, I'll take it. Caught him with the blue card. Have a green. Of course, gonna go for it. But yeah, it's reset day. Um, we're still facing some decent teams, though. I'll be honest. And you wanna keep uh, swapping out as much as possible early on with this Goku because um, he gets that 40% damage inflicted buff to all allies which is massive, honestly. Um, okay, I'm just gonna go for this. Alright, that's the indestructible out the way. Yeah, indestructible has an age well, unfortunately. It's decent, but yeah. Okay, good play, he didn't, didn't go for taps, so he was able to PB. Alright, tank god Piccolo, buddy, this blue. Honestly, that's not bad tanking, gotta be honest. I did build him fairly tanky, so yeah, they, they really should have just awakened this plat and gone crazy with it. UI was just nonsense. Okay, so you guys saw that? Beast went for his main, killed my Vanish, but I just get Vanish back because of Piccolo's main. Pretty fun interaction there. Nope, not gonna work. Does he know? I think he's just gonna go for something. Yep. No, sir. Have a green card as well. Ah, damn it. The AI I all that's that's one mechanic in the game that I've forgotten more than anything else. The damn uh, AOE notification. Okay. 
this is fine. Okay, the lag isn't fine. Uh, let's just go here. Drop out. I don't know what that was about. Sure. We should be able to get a kill here. Enough Blast Arts. Okay. Goodbye, UI. Oh man, it would be perfect if I can set up an LF with the the god Piccolo. Really? Okay, that's fine. Um, doesn't matter. We have the 40% damage from this guy, so he's doing more than enough to support the team. Okay, let's see if Piccolo can use that damage buff. Really? Come on. Um, if he has a blue card, he can probably kill here. Okay. Great lag. Okay, I have to switch there. There's still a chance, though. Still a chance for the yellow. Hmm. Actually, maybe not. Uh, hello? Okay, you know what? Uh, I'm just gonna go for it. I don't care. Uh, he was gonna lose there anyways. I might as well get the elephant because I haven't seen it in forever. I'm sure you guys haven't seen it in forever either. Okay, bot. Get out of here. Get special beam cannon. Alright, GT this time. No, sir. Oh, wow. Goes right away there. That's interesting. I was trying to set up a jump jump, but. Alright. Fair enough. Let's go to Piccolo, eat these hits. And goes right away. Alright. Not the greatest start. have a green card and you know who can use that <laughs> yeah it's a uh, main gimmick to be honest <laughs> all right let's uh just get covered all here and then swap again i am trying to get uh oh okay uh, he's gonna be taking a lot of damage here oh well that's right sure that's big now we get the full damage buff and Catch there, okay. I'm gonna transform here. I think you wanna transform as early as possible with Piccolo, because he gains buffs after transforming, so. Um, yeah, okay, that was pretty predictable drop. No. Yeah, he goes right away there. Got a tap. Okay, this should be. Yeah. Should be a kill on someone, to be honest. G4, huh? That was kind of your best bet. Alright, fair enough. Wow, so someone I guess just wants to try Ultra Broly? I think not on him on a mono purple team, which is interesting. Sure. I honestly probably will do a Ultra Bo Brawly re revisit. Oh god. So I'm going to speak here. But yeah. Um, I mean, he is quite star dependent. I don't think this was the highest star Ultra Brawly. At the moment I go up to do something. So. It's fine. Piccolo is going to be great in this one. Look at that. Of course, this isn't an optimized setup for Frieza, so he's not going to be doing a ton of damage. Okay. 
Catch him with the jump. Let's go. Some damage. Let's swap here. Predictable drop as well. Lag. Okay, sure. Um, I'm gonna go for the green. Okay, you can swap here and then just go for the ultimate. Uh, yeah. Perfect. Should kill. Come on, Goku. Yeah. Okay. Let's go for the green. Think he's sidestepping. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Get out of here. Uh, we are going to take some damage from the comeback, of course. But look at that. Piccolo with 4 million HP. Imagine he got a broken plat equip. Or the plat awakening for his equip. Such a fumble, man. Like, I can't. I don't understand the decisions at times. Okay. Uh, no key. Hello. Okay. That's fun. I love not being able to use any of my cards. Yeah, Frieza's kind of ridiculous in that aspect. Hopefully, the next, like, super strong release has uh, immunity to the arts increase. Whether it's LF Kaioken or Vegeta. Let me know what you guys think is coming up. Sir. Yeah, pretty predictable rush. Okay, not sure what he was trying to do. Hmm. Swap should be able to get a kill here. Uh, I'm gonna have to drop here just to get that. Okay. Yeah, Barku is doing pretty well with the 40% damage that, that Goku is providing. <laughs> Looks like it's time for another LF. This time it's 100% uh, legit. Alright, facing Sun Fam again, but uh, with Ultra Gohan here. Pretty interesting team. Definitely good. <laughs> Much better than uh, what I'm running right now. Okay, barely able to outblast there. Uh, interesting backup. Sure. Uh, hope this isn't a bot. Because usually bots like do the quick back up okay no it's definitely not a bot all right let's just keep it going that's good damage from Barku and uh, just FYI in case any of you are thinking of summoning I would recommend not to on the banners they released this week Probably, of course not. Barku, like, they're okay, but not good enough right now. I'd definitely say. Okay. It's fine. I can swap out. Now we have the full damage buffs from uh, the Zenkai Goku. What? The range blue card. Okay. Yeah, that's a play. Let's get banished back. Alright, just gonna go for that there. Didn't feel like risking Beast covering him. Okay. Bit of a tricky spot here. The lag is making it more difficult to move it on to. Okay. Alright. No, sir. Yeah, this team is quite scary. You are. Hello? I'm, I'm sorry. You guys saw me tapping a million times there, right? <sighs> I hate the misinputs in this game. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? 
Also, Goku did a great job of tanking there. Like, what the hell? Yeah, 20 or 200 K defenses with just minimal arts boost. I think he he approaches 210 K if you fully arts boost him. So one of the tankier units in the game. Oh, Missing puts aside. I guess I'm glad we saw his tanking. Right. That's fine. Wow, he waits there. Okay, that's a good play. That's a good play. Quite uh, different from what we've seen so far from this guy. Alright, I kind of just don't want to trigger the lock-in. Right. I'm gonna swap here. There's no way you rush the load, right? There's, there's no way. There's, like, not a chance, right? Oh my god, you suck. Oh. I mean, it's a smart choice by him, but you just suck, dude. Like, <laughs> rushing LF Piccolo, man. Oh. Yeah, it is the good, it is the right play. Yeah, I'm not taking anything away from it, but nah, just, uh, I hit you now. Okay. Perfect blaster and uh, Ultra Bones out of here. Okay, uh, not great, but I did save the indestructible with these guys just for that. Alright, he's out of his gauge. Looks like he's getting a bit hasty. Okay. Uh, no, okay, that, that was bad. I'm just gonna, gonna go for the rush. So, the main there wasn't ideal, but it brought Barku's sub count down. So, it might be handy right now. Yeah, just keep that in mind. The main with this guy is fairly uh, high utility. Hello, tap! Oh my god, oh my god. Twice in one match, you guys have seen me you've seen me tap the screen. You can see it there. Both situations, the game didn't give me taps. <sighs> this is so annoying. Very annoying. Alright, but uh, these guys can't do much here. Or these can't do much here. Look at the tank. He's type neutral, by the way. Of course, this isn't a optimized juiced beast setup, but that's still very impressive. Not sure why he just didn't go for the blue. Okay. Should be GG here. Oh, perfect. Let's get the LF with these guys. Been a while since I've seen it too. Hopefully he lets us get it. Okay, perfect. Alright, so we're facing GV, this is more like a reset day team that you face. <laughs> but uh, I mean, Ultra Gohan's still on the team, so I gotta be a little careful, but. Should be fine for the most part. Gonna go for the drop there. We have two green cards, so that might be pretty good. And one thing to keep in mind on this team, Piccolo actually holds two blast cards, so we're gonna be drawing more blast cards than strike. Um, yeah, something to keep in mind. Even though like the team is mostly strike based. Okay. Ooh, big damage. Goodbye, Pan. Yeah. Okay. I'll take that PV. Let's uh, go and pick a little, see him do something. Get this in so that we can uh, get those timer based buffs. Okay. Catch him with the jump jump. Ooh. <laughs> 
might be in another LF here, possibly. Um, let's just try to swap it out a bit. Okay, green card there. Um, sure, I'll leave this with Barku. Um, probably lose the first life. Although, his team isn't, yeah, his team isn't quite good enough. Or optimized, I should say. Okay, sure. Alright, I can just get the indestructible proc. Perfect. Alright, let's see if he lets us get it. Got the green. Charged up. Alright, looks like another one. Facing a Unilab team here. Uh, he's running the UI Plat actually. It's kind of unfortunate. <laughs> Don't want to touch on it too much because I'll be giving him another chance, um, possibly tomorrow's video. So we'll see how he does there, but it's kind of a disappointment. They definitely held back and fumbled with it, to be honest. Okay. A lot of damage he's taking here. I'm gonna go for the drop. Or, I wanted to drop, but sure. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, just kind of running through his team. God damn. Just the 20% extra damage. It's definitely noticeable. Then we can get the 40 here. Actually, I'm gonna go for the transformation first. Oh wow, good delay. Waited out the jump jump. Um, I'm guessing he has some green cards here. Yeah. Evil can can pop off a bit, I guess. All right. <laughs> We're taking uh, zero damage. So good stuff. Nah, even, even type disadvantage for barely taking anything. Uh, this is just tragic. I mean, also this Goku seems like a, an incredibly good tank. Yeah, Alright, swap here. Oh, goes for tabs. Okay, this guy's a good player actually, he's been making some good plays. Uh, can get banished back. Yeah. Alright. Okay, on to the next one. Alright guys, so recording kind of failed here, so I'm going to be doing a voiceover for this last match. So yeah, facing this team, um, it's like Super 17 on Sunfam, I guess. Yeah, it's a pretty good match to showcase some aspects, like, uh, yeah, Goku eating that decently well, you know. It's not the greatest, but I'll take it. Up here. Yeah, just got it in time so that the gauge wouldn't proc. Yeah. Uh, yeah, just insane damage. And the thing is, I go for the blue card here, he got scared and swapped. <laughs> this is pretty funny. Super 17 got nuked. Sometimes plays like that work out, you just gotta try for it. Yeah. yeah, honestly this was fun. I really wish they had given the Awakening to Piccolo's Plaid. Would have made it uh, uh, at a good time, honestly. And Regen needed it too. But uh, you know what, it is what it is. Hopefully they do good on the rest of the campaign. And this Goku, I can definitely see myself using him a lot. The uh, support, the main ability, all of it's quite good, honestly. Yeah. 
Yeah, just catch him on the jump jump there. Match is pretty much wrapped up at this point. I did go for the drop and uh, yeah, couldn't quite continue it after that. Yeah. Did I rush ever in this video? This might have been a no rush video. Uh, although I might be forgetting. Yeah, this was fine here. Again, I could just stay in and eat it. Except for that. Eat it as well there. Yeah. This Goku is one of the best Zenkais. Or sparking Zenkais at least. Definitely up there with uh, the likes of survival cell and stuff. Of course he's not going to be as crazy because he's not juiced up as much with Super 17, but still up there. Okay. And then I believe I just get UI out here. So uh, this is kind of a funny scenario here that uh, comes up. I'm trying to go for the LF and here I was just praying he'd rush. And guess what? <laughs> He went for it, and that was all she wrote. But yeah, we got to see a ton of uh, Piccolo LFs in this one. Did cut off the previous one because I didn't want to show all of them, but definitely nice. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace.